This is Duke News Junkie the Second, and this is my take on the news. Today's news story comes from France. I've included the link in the description below, but if you don't want to read it, then this is the summary. Basically, Europe's oldest person, a French nun named Sister Andre, caught and recovered from COVID-19, and soon after celebrated her 117th birthday. Born in 1904, Sister Andre caught the virus at the nursing home where she lived in the city of Toulon. 81 out of the 88 residents there caught COVID. Sister Andre exhibited no symptoms, but of course was confined to her room, where the only complaint she had was solitude. She told a newspaper she didn't even know she had it. A spokesperson for the nursing home said she had no fear of the virus. She also didn't inquire about her own health, but inquired about her routine instead. She was more worried about meal time and bedtime changing. Asked if she was scared to have COVID, she said, "No, I'm not scared to have COVID because I'm not afraid to die. I'm happy to be with you." But I wish I were somewhere else to join my big brother and my grandma and grandpa. Sister Andre, who is blind and in a wheelchair, worked as a governess and tutor before entering a convent in 1944. At the age of 40, she has been living in nursing homes since 1979. The nun is the world's second oldest person, according to the Gerontology Research Group World Super Centenarian Rankings List. When asked about how she had lived so long, she said, "I have no idea what the secret is. Only God can answer that question. I've had plenty of unhappiness in life, and during World War One, I suffered." Just like everyone else. All right, my verdict is short and sweet. This is a nice story about longevity. Now, I personally wouldn't want to live that long. I mean, she's blind and in a wheelchair. It doesn't sound like a good quality of life to me, but when God wills you to live to 117, then well, I guess you have no choice. Anyway, what do you think of the story? Post your comments below. This is Duke News Junkie the Second, and this was my take on the news. Don't forget to subscribe and support me on Patreon. If you like to read novels, check out my latest. A Prince and a Rain Spirit, available on Amazon. The link is down below. Until next time, don't forget, it's a messed up world.